Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today, we're gonna talk about Stan Arrows from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. The reason I'm doing this video is because most of JoJo fans thought there was only two types of arrows, which is the Requiem Arrow and the Norman Arrow. But there's actually six types of arrows are mentioned in the manga. Let's talk about the abilities of Stan Arrow. 1. It can stimulate the Stan ability of a creature, and the target must be a creature. It does not need to have full thinking ability, but must be in a state of survival. 2. Each Stan Arrow carries a mysterious alien virus that can kill people. 3. Alien viruses have an extremely high fatality rate, but also survive to obtain Sando POWER! 4. The alien virus on the Stan Arrow can directly act on the human soul. 5. The strength and types of alien virus carried on each arrow is all different. 6. Stan Arrows cannot be destroyed by the time erosion. 7. Stan Arrow can assimilate into stands and disappear completely. According to earliest records, a cluster of characters in Kapjork, Finland, carries a mysterious alien virus that can stimulate the human body's strong sense of self-protection. But most people die by the multiplying of the mysterious virus. The very few who survive will release their spirit powers, which is the stand power. According to Ponalev's investigation, the material of the arrow is the same as the meteorite. And from the historical records, he knows that the ancients used meteorite to make those stand arrows in order to obtain a powerful force comparable to that of the gods. The exact number and the location are unknown. The information disclosed so far is as early as in 1986 by Diavolo, who was only 19 at the time. He stole six arrowheads belonging to cultural relics by excavating ruins in Egypt including one uniquely shaped arrowhead and five similar arrowheads, and then he's missing. According to his own describing, Diavolo kept one normal arrow and sold the other five at a high price to a both hands or right hands old woman, which is Granny Enya. Then Diavolo returned to his hometown and opened up his dark empire. At the same time, Dio was salvaged out of the sea. Then he met Granny Enya and weakened his stand ability, the world. We have a reason to believe that Dio weakens the world by the stand arrow from Enya. After that, Dio always carries one uniquely shaped arrowhead with him. We can easily guess that the arrow who gets Dio his stand ability. In the following period, one of those four arrows from Granny Enya are purchased by Kira Yoshihiro who is traveling to Egypt. This arrow made him and his son Kira Yoshikage gain their stand abilities. During Dio's trip to America, he gave that uniquely shaped arrowhead to Enrico Pucci, and this arrow let him awaken his stand, White Snake, and his brother also gained his stand, Weather Report by Blood Relation. In the days after, Enrico Pucci returns the arrow to Dio. In the following years, Dio is killed by Jotaro, and those four stand arrows are all missing. During his 10 years, Nijimura Kaichu investigated his father's mutation and found one Stan Arrow. And this Stan Arrow made him and his brother Nijimura Okuyasu gain their Stan ability, Bad Company and The Hand. After that, the uniquely shaped arrowhead was found by Paul Nalef, who was searching in Egypt and Europe. And two Stan Arrows did not explain whereabouts. Okay, let's take a comprehensive look at these six Stan Arrows. Chronologically, their past owners are as follows. Standard number one is Diavolo, Polpo, and then is broken by the banana gun and then is missing. Standard number two is Diavolo, Granny Enya, Kira Yoshihiro, Kira Yoshikage, and then is missing. Standard number three is Diavolo, Granny Enya, Nijimura Kaicho, Akira Otoishi, Jotaro Kujo, and then Speed the Wagon Foundation. Stan Arrow number 4 and 5 are both Diavolo, Granny Enya, and they are missing. Stan Arrow number 6, which is a uniquely shaped one, first is Diavolo, Granny Enya, Dio, Enrico Pucci, Dio, Paul Naref, Diavolo, Shiller Charles Requin, and then Giorno Giovanna. Also, most people don't know which one the arrow that stabbed Jorin. According to my speculation, it should be Stan Arrow number 1. 
Why? Because when Jotaro gives a pendant to Jorini, you can see there is only a piece of stain arrow. According to Jotaro and Speedwagon Foundation's cautions and how much they cheers the stain arrow, I don't think they would break it. So the only possibility is when Giorno became the Mafia boss and he gave that broken stand arrow or a piece of it to Speedwagon Foundation because of Pona Ref. So, stands that are made by stand arrow number one is King Grimsel, Black Sabbath, Clash, Talking Head, Stone Free, Notorious B.I.G., Green Day, Oasis, Mr. President, Metallica, Little Feet, Man in the Mirror, The Grateful Dead, Beach Boy, Babyface, White Album, Soft Machine, Kraftwerk, Sticky Fingers, Sex Pistols, Aerosmith, Moody Blues, and Purple Hate. Stands that are made by Stan Arrow number 2 is Atom Heart Father. Killer Queen and Killer Queen by Sadust, Boy to Man, Stray Cat, Superfly, Enigma, Cheap Trick, Highway Star. Stands that are made by Stan Arrow number 3 is Bad Company, The Hand, Aqua Necklace, Echoes, Heaven Store, The Lock, Service, Love Deluxe, Cinderella. Harvest, Rat, Red Hot Chill Paper. Stand arrow number 4 and 5 have no clue about them since I can't find any introduction. Stands that are made by stand arrow number 6, which is a Requiem arrow, is The World, White Snake, Weather Report, Star Platinum, Hermint Purple, Fern Like Stand, Crazy Diamond. Gold Experience Requiem and Shiver Chariot Requiem. You might ask why Star Platinum, why Hermit Purple, why Crazy Diamond? Because blood relation. Let me give you an example. Imagine you get a stand arrow, you stab it yourself and success! You get a stand now. Guess what will happen? Your family members who have blood relations with you will all get a stand too. Even if they're not worthy. Jotaron didn't weaken a stand by himself. Is because Dio is using Jonathan's body and used Requiem Arrow on it. Also, you don't get stronger stands by using Requiem Arrow. You will always get the same stand no matter which stand arrow you used. But stand arrow will matter when you try to evolve your stand into next level. Okay guys, that's all for today's video. This took me so long to make, but hope this video will help you and also help your friends who doesn't know anything about stand arrows. If you like this video, you can leave a like and subscribe, I would be really appreciated. Also join my discord, link will be in the description. Thank you very much for watching and see ya!